Good evening, call. everyone, and welcome to another yeah, Wellness Stories, time. Monday Night Wellness Stories. I'm Sherry Danzig, and tonight you're going to hear some great stories about, I don't know what, we sometimes have a theme, tonight we do not, so you're going to hear a story that is a personal testimonial about one of the Niken wellness technologies mm -hmm. that has had a really big impact on the individual or perhaps a family. I don't know. We hear, I never get tired of hearing these stories. They're amazing stories. So you won't get an explanation about the product. You're going to hear simply a story, someone's experience. If you're listening to this and you have questions, just get back to the person that invited you to listen and they can fill in the gaps. So we're going to kick it off first with Gloria. So Gloria, please share the story you've got for us tonight. Hi, everyone. Uh, yeah, this happened uh, just yesterday. Uh, we've been around uh, the products for over 25 years. And so we are always delighted when we have a personal experience in our house. And my husband worked very hard all his life using his hands in heavy equipment and heavy construction. So his hands are always, to me, looking a little swollen. He, he, he's just abused the joints and abused them. Men use their hands as hammers. In, and I even watched him doing some work on the irrigation system. And he was just not using tools. You know, these were his tools. But he was really complaining about one finger. And I said, I know you don't wear jewelry. But I said, you want to try the knee can ring? Because, you know, it helped my knuckle. And he said, fine, but how's it going to fit me? So I opened it up. I didn't know how much that ring could even open, but I opened it up and he <laughs> forced it he over his it. knuckle. And uh, an hour later, he hands it back to me. And I said, well, did you have a result? He goes, well, I guess so, because it started to fall off. So he wow. had to force it on over a swollen hand and then it started to fall off. Wow. Guess it wow. did something good for him. <laughs> Must have. That's awesome. He could yeah. still keep wearing it though, you know, that he might be a man that doesn't want to wear jewelry. I don't know. Go figure. Thank you, Gloria. Kim, you've got a story. I have. So we don't have any allergies in our families. We never have. We just you know, some families have allergies, some families don't. We've never had allergies. We have takeaways in all of the kids' bedrooms. We always have done. Um, it's great with the teenagers because you know how bad their rooms can smell if they don't have one in it. So I make sure that they all have one in their rooms and that fresh air. And we, we sometimes have one in our bedroom, not all the time. But of this past season, we've had some random allergy thing going on in Utah where there's some I don't know I, I've never had allergies before but I have been suffering with really bad hay fever never had before but my nose was blocked I was sneezing I was bunged up I was everything and it was so bad and um I don't know why I didn't think about the kenkaway Ben actually came to me he's like well let's get a kenkaway and he put it right next to my side of the bed and he put it on and I kid you not, within 10, 15 minutes, my nose was clear and everything. And now I will not be in this room, sleep in my bedroom without that kankawa next to me. Because as soon as I go outside, it all comes back and I come back in and I sit right there. Within 15 minutes, I am better again. And I I just love it so much. Got to figure out, like, you, you're a DIY person, so you got to figure out a way to like build a, a belt or something so it can just you can just carry it with you around the house. It's lightweight <laughs> enough, but it would be a little, might be a little awkward, but <laughs> that's awesome. Thanks for sharing. Audrey, you've got a story for us tonight, please. Yes. Um, it's been about 25 years ago that my husband and I learned of Nikon and the amazing products that there are. He had an experience, and therefore, we decided we have to learn more. And we just bought almost everything right away. <laughs> and I, I didn't think I needed them. It wasn't for me. But I was vacuuming, and the pool of vacuum just 
was killing my back. So I thought, well, what do we have that I could use? So I went and I got the flex and I put it in my pants and it wasn't even two minutes, like you say, five minutes, whatever, just a few minutes. And when I'm pushing and pulling that vacuum back and forth, I couldn't even tell. Yeah. So I am still using the flex today. Yep. <laughs> and it's been 25, this is a different flex. It's been 25 years though. Mm -hmm. The stuff is amazing. Mm -hmm. It really you is. You never know what it'll do. Yeah, yeah. And you know, when you wear it all the time, it's, it's, you kind of forget sometimes. Right. There's been a few times where I took it out and set it down. It's very rare, but it's kind of a good thing when I, when I do that, because then I get away. Sometimes I'm just downstairs in my office and I'm like, why is my back bothering me? And I realized the flex never got put back in my britches. Right. So it's, it's sometimes you forget what it does until you stop using it. And then you have that comparison. And I, Audrey, I have that on my back, that same flex every minute of the day, except for when I'm in the shower, because there's nothing to stick on it, but that's it. Otherwise it is on my back all the time, except the few times I've forgotten. So I hear you. And you know, I have a friend that bought one and what she did where these little holes are, uh -huh. she went ahead and made a slit on either side where the holes are. Okay. And then she put a, uh, not a tape, but fabric, uh -huh. a string, but fabric through that and ties it around her waist to keep oh. it on her back. Okay. All right. Well, I've just, because I've worn it for so long, I wear either bike shorts or stretchy pants or, you know, something that it stays in place. So, right. You know, I, I tell women when I'm introducing it to them, if you wear a thong, it's not going <laughs> to stay in the thong. <laughs> Otherwise, you can usually just stick it in your drawers. So, right. Yes. Thank you so much. When mm -hmm. you've got a story, please share. Yes. Um, I have a family member, my sister in law, haven't seen me um, about two months, over two months. So, I took get together with them this weekend. She said, What did you do to your skin? It looks so radiant. I said, The only thing I did is I take pink collagen complex for this is my seven weeks not not seven weeks it's 60 you know three or 64 days mm -hmm. and he said oh my god it looks so good so she said uh send me information today i went to post office and sent to her and then sent her the, the video uh 18 minutes and uh, i so she watched it and then i did another client uh, last week too i sent her a video and gave her a sample and follow up with them in a couple of days. Yeah. Yeah. It's great when people haven't seen you in a while, because then they can really see the difference. Okay. Awesome. And Shirley, you've got a story to share. You got to just unmute and you're good to go. Uh, <laughs> yes. Here. I have a very good friend that had to leave St. Louis. And I think she's been back for about two years. And when she came back, I kept sending her texting her invitations. She never would come. All of a sudden, she called me one day. She said, I'll be there. Her name is Dora. And when she came, she saw the uh, waterfall. And she was like, oh, this water is so good. And I told her how much it was. She said, OK, this is when I'm going to get it. She wrote it down on a piece of paper. She got that waterfall. Then she started coming to almost every presentation I had. And she stood up and she said, I just want to say something. She said, I owe Shirley an apology because she's been sending me invitations and I never came. She said, I wished I would have came to the first one that she had. Mm -hmm. She came back. She got the max steps. She said, Shirley, she's been putting them in her socks. She's been sleeping in them. Her legs is not bothering her anymore. She came back. She got the knee wraps. And she got, she said, I have two knees. She got two knee wraps. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? 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 H
Whoops, we lost you, Shirley. She wants to try to be wrapped, so she's getting her, her old ones. She bought two. Um. Okay, can you hear me now? Yes, now we can hear you. Okay, okay. So, um, she she bought two knee wraps today because she's gonna give her daughter her old ones, and then the next time she came, she bought the uh Kinko Mag Duo because her arm uh was wasn't feeling good. She bought the CM cream. She bought the moisturizer for her face. She got the collagen. She said, Shirley, my face look good. My hands look good. And <laughs> it's just, she's been sharing with her daughter. She wouldn't give her daughter a whole pack of collagen. She told her, I'm going to give you one pack. Why did her daughter say, Mama, I want some that collagen? So she already told me, Shirley, when I come on the 23rd and we have our event, she said, my daughter's coming. She, I, she, I finally made her out of the believer. And she just like all of the products that we have. So I'm excited. So she's uh, going to tell her sister and bring more people. That's awesome. Okay. That's wonderful. I love it when people just keep coming back for more. We we say you start building your wellness home, but there's there's really no end. There's always a beginning, but not really an end. So Okay, well, thank you so much, everyone, for sharing. These were great stories. And I think next week when we come back, we're going to, I think we're about at the 90 days because it's been February, March, April, May. Well, let's see. So March, April, May. So I think we're at the 90 days. Mm -hmm. I've been wanting every 30 days to do the um, collagen. So I think we'll go there. Mm -hmm. Hang on.